I know it is. Because that's how guidance comes. Out of desperation. That's how it comes. Allah yujibun mutar ida da'ahu. Allah answers the mutar. Ya Allah. But if you say, Allah nafhili wa rahalli wa tuba'ali. There has to be azima. There has to be sidqa tawajjuh in Allah. This is how Allah answers you. We're not people of fun. Fun in English, you look it up in the dictionary. You know what fun means? It means the activity of fools. That's what fun means in English. And Islam offers people a chance to become Adamic human beings. That's what Islam offers us. A chance to be Adamiyun. To be min Bani Adam. وَلَقَدْ كَرَّمْنَا Bani Adam. Bani Adam is mukarram. Al Adamiyun, we're Adamiyun, we're people of Adam, alayhi salam, the first human being created to know Allah, to know Allah, alaykum bil ruhi, alaykum bil ruhi, take care of your soul, alaykum bil nafsi, fastakmil fadailaha, fa anta bil ruhi, la bil jasidi insanu, take care of your soul, perfect it, give it good qualities, give it virtuous qualities of erudition, of learning of depth, of profundity, of care, of compassion, of, of seriousness in your life. Because it's by the ruh, it's by the nafs that you are a human being, not by your body. You share your body with donkeys, and with goats, and with chickens and hens. But the ruh, you don't share that with anything of Allah's creation. And that's what, that's what singles us out. That's what gave us our, our, our our spirit, that's what gave us the, the capacity to do what we do. It's because the ruh and the ruh of the amal, al amal, that all the actions are ashbah, wal arwahu, sirrul ikhlasi fiha. All of your actions are like bodies, and the ruh that animates the action is sirrul ikhlas. It's done for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So be people of adab. And if you want to be people of adab, you have to sit with the people of adab. Sidi Ali al-Jamal, one of the big uh, people of this city. He said, balik sibaha. Put your mind at ease. Relax and learn to swim. Relax and learn to swim. Learning is a process. I'll guarantee you, if you people, even the people having a difficult time, if you're sincere and you stick through these dirses and you work hard, I guarantee you'll have an opening from Allah. That's my guarantee. I mean, it's not true. Come to me and tell me. I know it's true. I guarantee you. By Allah. I, can, I, I guarantee you. By Allah. By Allah. You'll have an opening from Allah. I knew people. I had a student who studied with me once a week two hours a week, once a week for one year he learned Arabic. Because he had him ma'adi. We had a student there who went to to Mauritania. Young man, he had been accepted to the, one of the best universities in the United States. His father was going to pay for everything. He had a car. He had everything he needed. And he wanted to go study knowledge in the desert of Mauritania with Murat <laughs> al his, his parents actually told him that they might disinherit him if he did that. And he went, and he's there now. He lived in a very nice house. There's another uh, brother, American, who went there, two, almost two years he stayed there, from one of the, uh, a very wealthy family in America, living in air conditioned, beautiful house, everything. He went there. That's Himma. When I was on Hajj this last year, I was walking with Sheikh Abdullah, uh, Wild Ahmedna, my Sheikh. And he's a young man, 28. And he's Adam. And he has incredible piety. And we were walking uh, to Muzdalafa from Arafah. And s there were so many people, like just hundreds, tens of thousands of people. Everybody's crowded. And we walk by an old lady from Turkey. Her back, she was bent over like that. Like that, bent over. And she had a walking stick. She was walking like this. 
holding on to her husband's ihram like that. And she... <laughs> People in air-conditioned buses, it was hot. And I looked at that woman, she, could, she must have been 80, something like that. And I looked at Sheikh Abdullah and I said, Subhanallah, what is that? And he said, Al-Himma? Al-Himma? That's aspiration? That's Himma? And this is an Ummah of Himma Aliyah. It's not an Ummah of Himma Daniya. One of the shiukh said, if they're going to hang you, ask them to hang you from the highest tree. Have Himma Aliyah. Be people of Himma. Make your concerns with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The, the, a man's heart is at his treasure. Whatever you worship, that's where your heart's going to be. If you worship Allah, your heart's with Allah. They say the definition of a wali of Allah, if he's in the sun, he doesn't want to be in the shade. If he's in the shade, he doesn't want to be in the sun. In other words, if he's in ni'ma, he doesn't want to be in ibtila. And if he's in ibtila, he doesn't want to be in ni'ma. He's pleased wherever Allah put him. He's pleased wherever Allah put him. Our Prophet didn't complain. Wallahi lam yashtaki nabiyuna. Man batha falam yasbir sabran jameela. Whoever complains, he hasn't shown patience. Sayyidina Ya'qub, sabrun jameel. Ya'ani sabr biduni shakwa. Sabrun jameel. Wallahi al-musta'an. And Allah is the isti'ana. Iyaka na'abudu wa iyaka nasta'in. So, one of the things, let me just read one thing from Sidi Ahmed Zarruq for the Barakah He said something here very beautiful. He said that the, from the nasiha to Allah is a nusra li deenillah. And look what he says here. He says, وَالثَّارِثْ مِنْ وُجُوهَ النُّصْرَةِ الْقِيَامُ بِالْأَسْبَابِ الْمُوْجِبَةِ لِبَقَائِهِ مِنْ عِلْمٍ وَعَمَلٍ From the nusra of this deen is to, to establish the means whereby the deen continues on to the next generation in knowledge and in action. So what you're doing here, what you're learning here, make the intention to give nusra to the deen of Allah. إِنْ تَنْصُرُ اللَّهِ يَنْصُرُكُمْ كُنُوا أَنْصَارًا لِلَّهِ be Ansar for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Hubb al-Ansar min al-Iman. Love of the people who give victory to this deen is from Iman. Nuhubb al-Ansar. We love them. Ha'ula al-ladheena nasuru Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Walakin, hadha al-hadith yadullu kadharika ala ala anna al-hubb li kulli man nasara deen al-Islam yajibu alayna an nuhubbahu. Anyone who gives nusra to this deen, victory, we have to love him. And من أسباب النصرة أنك أننا نقوم بالأسباب الموجبة لبقاء هذا الدين من علم وعمل لما تتعلمون التجويد أنتم تضمنون أن التجويد سيستمر في هذه الأمة إلى الجيل القادم حديث النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم قال When you learn tajweed, your your Guaranteeing that Tajweed will go to the next generation. لِأَنَّ الْعِلْمَ يُؤْخَذُ مِنْ أَفْوَاهَ الرِّجَالِ لَا مِنْ سُطُورِ الْكُتُبِ شَيْخِ قَالَ الْعِلْمُ يُؤْخَذُ مِنَ الصُّدُورِ لَا مِنَ السُّطُورِ Knowledge is taken from breath, not from lines on a book. And now the سِرُّ دِينِنَا الدين عندنا أحد العلماء قال هذا الدين أكرم بثلاث بالأنساب وبالإسناد this deen has ansab. We know who we are. We know who we come from. It has isnad, chain, unbroken chain, sanad, muttasil. Lama naqra al-ajr rumiya ma'a shaykh Abdul Hayyid Imrawi hunaka sanad muttasil ila ibn ajarrum. Li'annahu talaqqa hadha al-kitab fil qarawiyin. Wa ibn ajarrum kana yudarrisu hadha al-kitab huna. Fa shiyukh akhadu anhu. وهؤلاء علموا تلاميذتهم وتلاميذتهم أصبحوا شيوخا وعلموا تلاميذتهم هلم جرا إلى يومنا هذا. That's the secret of this deen, transmission, the sir of transmission, نقل. لو أراد الله